Hello. Hello, Sarah Nicole. Hello. Sarah Nicole Carter. That's How me. are you? I'm good, thank you. How are you? I'm good. Um, today we are interviewing one of our chorus members, Sarah Nicole, and I will start asking you um, what type of voice you have and also when did you start your collaboration with San Diego Opera? Sure. Uh, I'm a mezzo-soprano, so middle voice. I started singing with San Diego Opera in 2015. So my first show was Great Scott and I was extra chorus for that. And then the next year I became core chorus. And so I've sung with San Diego Opera ever since. And um, I actually though started going to San Diego Opera when I was like seven years old because I grew uh -huh. up in San Diego. So my family took me when I was little and I had season tickets until I went away to college and loved it. So seeing San Diego Opera is one of the things that inspired me to get a degree in it. That's fantastic. How great. Kudos to you. <laughs> um, second question. Please name two favorite icons, two favorite singers and an aria that we can pair with with one of them. Sure. Um, it's hard to narrow it down to two. I'm sure anybody else you ask has said the same yeah. thing. Um, I think Lorraine Hunt Lieberson is probably my favorite mezzo-soprano. She uh, tragically passed away from cancer in around 2006, but two of my favorite pieces that she recorded mm -hmm. were Neruda songs, which her husband wrote for her um, to perform. So she is this recording of Pablo Neruda's Is this um, uh, Peter Lieberson's one? Yeah, mm -hmm. okay. exactly. Yeah. yeah. So I love that set. I think that's one of the most gorgeous song cycles. She also did a recording of Mahler's Rukert Leader, which I think is an outstanding recording that everybody should go listen to immediately. Um, okay. Yeah, so good. And then uh, I love Gerald Finley. He did, uh, one of my favorite things he did was Dr. Atomic. And there's an aria at the end of the first act called Batter My Heart, which is based on the John Donne poem. Ooh! That is a good piece of music and he really just does an amazing job. So go listen to that. That's my well, thank you for sharing this. I'm sure uh, I will listen to this music and I'm sure our audience will too. And lastly, the last question is, if you could share with us a favorite place that you have in San Diego. Oh, that's another hard one. Um, growing up in San Diego, everything is so good, right? Um, <laughs> When I was little, we used to go to the tide pools at Cabrillo National Monument. And so that's one of my face, favorite places to take my kids now. Oh. We go to the tide pools, we go see the old Point Loma Lighthouse, and then we'll go down to Point Loma to Liberty Station mm -hmm. and have food. And that's just an amazing day and an amazing thing I like to share from my childhood to do with my kids. So, okay. So, um, thank you. Thank you so much for this interview. I'm sure, you know, we're going to be seeing you. Uh, we have some activities going on with the choristers. So uh, thank you. Thank you so much. My pleasure. Thank you.